What's up guys, welcome to A-Star for Pants And today I am back with another reaction video So, today I got a special treat for you guys, yeah Now, look, I'm not gonna lie to you This match was highly requested before it even took place It hadn't even happened yet And people were requesting this match like crazy, okay They were like, listen it's the, it's the, what, what is it? The Fla Flu or the Flu Fla? I can't, I, I always forget. Well, alright, well, Flamengo at home, Fluminense are away. So, we're gonna call it the Fla Flu. The Fla Flu Classico, yeah? And I was thinking, oh, okay. Alright, listen, we can get it popping. Like, we, we, we can do that. I can do that for sure. Um, with that being said, this is, this is, this is one of those games where the Fluminense supporters are like, listen, yeah. No matter what the score is, make sure you react to it. Even if we win, because they they seem to think yeah that I only react to Flamengo when they win in it. When at, at this point I'm only going off requests, so I don't know where the idea comes from. With that being said, I do believe this is the first match since those those young youth players passed away in that fire. So there might be a lot of emotions flying in this match. I'm not sure. But we'll see. This is the Carioca Real Estate Championships match. And I believe the winner goes into the final to, to face a certain Vasco, to face a certain Yago Pikachu. So you already know I'm gonna be reacting to that match as well. You know, I'm gonna be reacting to that match as well. But I think at this point we better get started. So make sure you smash up that like button, guys. Yeah. Let me make that full screen. Three, two, one, play. São 60 mil balões. Teremos muita emoção aqui no Maracanã. Wow, the stadium's crowded. And ao Arthur, ao Atila, ao Bernardo, ao Christian, ao Jedinho, Jorge, Pablo, Riquel, Samuel, Vitor. Oh yeah, those are the okay, that was a little homenageando os seus meninos. Alright. Yeah, see, there's already some tributes going around in the stadium already. Fla flu. See, they're saying it. Fla flu. Ain't that what I was saying? Fla flu. See, I got it right. I sound about this light, man. I don't know. See, there it is. All ten of them. That's a nice tribute. Gabriel. Okay, a few new players on show. Alright. VAR are in position. See, this is nice. A one minute silence. Você ligado nas emoções do campeonato carioca? Tem bola rolando. Segunda semifinal, bola do Fluminense de Ayrton. Chichi, técnico da seleção brasileira. Oh, Chichi é esse. Chichi. Estamos no início do jogão. Diego bateu de fora. Sobre o gol de Rodolfo. É tiro de meta para o Fluminense. Diego went for it early. Keeper had it covered though, I'm sure. It doesn't matter where that went. Pedro, centroavante do Fluminense. O artilheiro do ano passado no Fluminense. Linda imagem da homenagem da torcida do Flamengo. A torcida do Flamengo promete. A partir wow. de hoje, fazer essa homenagem aos 10 do primeiro tempo. Uau! Wow. Tenta isso aí, ó, a velocidade. Flamengo aposta no contra-ataque, no talento de Gabigol. O Marco Canaro está pronto. O Gabriel ajeitou, toca no meio. Olha o gol do Flamengo. Sabe, preciso tirar... Está defendendo, man. That's, that's sensational. Look, like, how did he get there in time? Without giving away a penalty. That's crazy. I can't believe that. Am I focused? Rodolfo! Rodolfo What to save. Oh, my gosh. Já tinha impedimento. Cabeçada do Rodolfo para defesa do Rodolfo. Keeper. Vem para cima do Pará. Am I in focus? I'm so confused. Hold on. Segue o lance. E agora o Everaldo pedindo um cartão por simulação. Everaldo já tem um cartão amarelo. Vamos respeitar um minuto de silêncio, homenagem. I don't know, man. It's tough. I don't know. Pinto juiz, Ricardo Boixá. 
torcedor do Flamengo, Bibi Ferreira, torcedora do Fluminense. Everton Ribeiro, cobrança por baixo, cruzamento do René, toque de cabeça, cabeçada. It's all Flamengo at the moment. I don't think I've seen a like a, a really productive. Oh, never mind. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> he got nicked off of him in the last second. Okay, so it's, it's Fluminense's turn to attack now. Guys, I don't know if I'm. Am I in focus or no? Se complicou, brigou com a bola, o Marlon perdeu. Chute no canto para fora do Bruno Henrique. Isso é um risco que o Fluminense corre. Everaldo, Johnny, de calcanhar bonito, lance Luciano, bateu pro gol. Mas aí? Não. Bom ataque do Fluminense. Com oh, the way he hit the net, I thought that was in. Falta pro Fluminense. Cruzamento na segunda trave. Olha a sobra, Luciano ajeitou o corpo, ajeitou bonito. Não, não. If he scored that, I would have gone crazy. I'm just telling you, if he scored that, it would have been mad. Well, well. Oh, share the keeper. This guy was top goal scorer last year, isn't it? It's been end to end. I'm not. The second half has been quite good. Wait, that was the last minute of the game. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. Luciano. Luciano. Damn. Smash and grab. I see that. I felt that. I don't know. The keeper maybe could have done a bit better with that. It looked quite central, but at the same time, that's an excellent finish. You gotta give it to them, that's an excellent finish, and they go crazy. Look at the celebrations, that's a, that's, that, that, that means a lot to them. The Fla Flu, do you know what I mean? Listen, the Fla Flu Classico, that's, that, those are bragging, that's everything, those are bragging rights. Plus, I think the winner goes to the final. That's big, that's big. You can see, you can see why they'll celebrate like that at the end. Um, wow. But yeah, I mean, that was kind of crazy because, like, don't get me wrong, in the second half, especially, both teams had quite a few chances, but over over the course of the whole game, it looked like it looked like Flamengo were dominating in terms of chances. You know, they were creating chances, they were dominating. Most of their shots were going straight to the keeper and stuff. They weren't too, they weren't too troubling. But it looked like, on the highlights, it looked like they were having a, 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 a bigger share of the chances. Now, first half goes, no goals. Second half goes, the 45 minutes goes, no goals. And then you're telling me into stoppage time, into, into injury time, yeah? Someone comes and scores the winner against you when, you when you've been dominating. That just shows, look, listen, you can't be complacent. Just because you've had chances, it doesn't mean nothing. It doesn't mean you deserve to win. You know what I mean? You've got to score goals to win. That's the fact. And Fluminense did that, so I've got to respect it. Now, hopefully, this has debunked that that assumption or that that this this thing that's going on in this channel that I only react to Flamengo when they win because clearly they just lost and you lot are about to see this and like I said I am going to react to the final of the Carioca Real Estate Championship match and I believe Vasco already made it my guy Yago Pikachu will be there hopefully yeah so it will be Vasco versus Fluminense now, I think. I'm not sure because there's certain about these these matches, these I, I don't know about it. They, sometimes things happen and you don't tell me, oh no, there's a second leg, there's this, there's that. Oh, you know, I don't really know how it works. But in my mind, if that's a semi-final, then Fluminense should be in the final, innit? And I believe Vasco's already there. So it'll be Vasco versus Fluminense in the final. And I'll be watching. I'll be watching. With that being said, when's my guy Pedro? When is he back? Was his name Pedro? The striker. Do you know what I'm talking about? The Fluminense striker. Where is he? Is he still injured? You lot know what I'm talking about. Is his name Pedro? I can't remember. He was top goal scorer in, uh, until he got injured. He was, he was moving mad. He was moving mad. I can't remember. I can't remember. But where is he? Where is he at? Let me know in the comments down below. And yeah. I guess we'll leave it there. Make sure you let me know your comments down below in the comments down below. This might be live as well. So if it is live, make sure you're smashing that like button, guys. Smash that like button all day, every day. 
and we'll leave it there. So, thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, then please make sure you really smash up that like button. As always, dive into the comments and let me know what else you'd like to see. Share the video because sharing is caring. And subscribe. Come and join the squad. Whoa. But after that, make sure you follow me on all my social media. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Until next time. Peace. I feel just like a rock star.